Hello everybody, it is I, Mr. Charlie Murray, and welcome back to another pack opening video. This time for the Eternal Commander packs. This kind of surprised me. There I was, just snugged in bed, just watching a film, watching the Princess Diaries, I'll have you know. Yeah, I know. Charlie, watching Princess Diaries, used to watch it a lot as a kid. So, I thought I'd watch it again, and I still love it! <laughs> I know, right? And then I see a tweet! The Eternal Command Pack is now live on the cartel market! What? Seriously? Damn you, Barbara! What is this, though? What? What is this icon? I guess we'll find that out in a minute! So, yes, we're going to be doing another pack. It's not even, it's been two weeks. It's not even been a month. Seriously, by the way, <laughs> you are really hurting my wallet. You are really hurting my wallet. Anyway, I guess I'll have to mention the winners of the last pack video then. So, I can now reveal that the winners of a super crate of this pack are Rosek from the Red Eclipse server. Artemisia, or Artemisia, from the Red Eclipse server, and Arunodos from the Progenitor server. So congratulations to you three. You have won yourself a super crate of this. Yeah, I know. And if you would like a chance to win the same for whatever the next will be, I have no idea what the next will be, or if there will even be a next one. Who knows? Then all you've got to do is post your character name, your server, and whether you are Republic or Empire, I'm going to guess by January, but that's what I said in the uh, last pack video, and look what's happened. Yeah, I mean, yeah, sure, I'll admit, it's 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 cheap. It's a lot cheaper than previous packs, but that's probably because it's 33% off compared to the others where, yeah, the prices have increased dramatically. Now, ladies and gentlemen, if you point your eyes to the top left of the screen... Hello! Yes! I am now going to be doing a face cam for my pack opening videos. It was one of the critiques which I, when I asked for some feedback in terms of my pack opening videos, I did get somebody say, face cam. And it really would show my reactions properly if I did have face cam. So, here we go. I mean, I don't know if it's going to work out. I mean, this is the first time I'm using face cam for this video. Um, I'm worried it may crash and burn, and you might not even be seeing this right now. But if you're seeing this, everything worked! If you're not seeing this, it didn't work. But you're not going to see this if it didn't work anyway. So, you're seeing this! Yay! Anyway. I know I'm sexy, right? Oh, sexy. Uh, apart from my eyes, let me look at this. Look at this, dark. Yes, I do sleep. Let us... i got a squeaky chair, by the way. Also, do you like my Christmas tree? for it. It lights up. It's beautiful. I don't even know if you can even see my Christmas tree. I can't see myself right now. I have no idea if my computer is tanky or not right now because I'm running OBS to record my, 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 my thingy. Um, that's a thought. Am I recording the right microphone? Better check that out. It's little things like that that panic me. I'm just like, <gasps> have I done this? Have I done that? So I've got OBS going. I've got Shadow Play going. I've got the game going. Got my Christmas tree lights going. I'm boiling hot. Should we actually get on with the bloody video, Charlie? Yes, we shall. Although, before we open the packs, I want to know what this icon is. Uh, an impressive set of quality ju ju juds. Yes, juds. Um, when open, a grand chance cube contains one item randomly drawn from a selection of cartel market items. One tier, five. Uh, contains a varied amount of scrap materials which can be traded to a scrap. But what is this? What is this? What is this? Oh, command experience, is it? Probably. Let's find out. Oh. Oh, it has that thing now, does it? Alrighty. So, is everything out of my item sash? Yes, it is. We shall begin with the first pack, which contains... Ah... Uh, Bold Helion's lower body armor and advanced Zakulan trashes receptacle, trash receptacle, whatever the heck this is. I guess it's like a trash can. Um, this is the gold item. I get the feeling this is the one from. Yes! Yes, it is. Is this just the lower body armor, though? It is the lower body. What did the higher body armor? Damn it. But I 
guess I'll have to go with it. First of all, we'll actually look at this, though, before we look at the lower body armor. So it is basically a trash can. It, what is it called? Uh, a receptacle. So does that mean it kind of, like, incinerates the trash? I have no idea. But that looks nice! I want, I want to get a few more of these, so that way I can put them around my uh, stronghold, because there's literally no bins in my stronghold. I think it's like the first bin they've actually put uh, in some packs. Okay, if you could bring me some more bins, that would be great. That sounds wrong. Yeah, bring bring me your bins, please. And we also have Bold Helian's Greaves and The Boots. Um, it's a bit weird, isn't it? Um, it looks like it's just been thrown together. i not entirely sure. I, I don't know. This is a bit weird. And then they've got like a little leather sort of belt and... I don't know, it just looks like someone's thrown it together, and this one it looks like it's trying to be PUNK ROCK! I don't know what I did there. PUNK ROCK! Yeah! I don't know. The next pack contains... Will you open that one please? We have Grantech F11D lightsaber, whatever that does. Uh, Alliance... Wait, 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 wait. Did I just get... Did I just... Did... Did I did did I did I just get platinum armor? And did did I or is it silver? I don't know. Is it platinum? Is it silver? Um, don't know. But I'm claiming that, and I'm claiming that. I feel excited right now for some reason. Um, uh, I'll take that, and I'll take that. That's a cool belt. That is a very cool belt. And the braces as well. That braces are actually quite nice. I like them. But this lightsaber. I'm curious. Um. Okay. I mean. There's nothing too vague. So maybe it is just a silver item. Though. I like how you can see his hair in the lightsaber. Maybe it is just a silver item. But I saw, I saw like silverish. It looked more whitish than silver. And I'm like. Did I just get a platinum item? But so I can't tell. I can't tell the difference between Swotor's platinum or silver. But yeah, there's the lightsaber. I mean, it's a lovely blue. I love that blue color. If you can move down, please. Oh, you won't move down. Oh, you actually won't move down. There we go. Let's scroll out. Yeah. The next pack contains. I guess we'll find out when we get silver. Um. So yeah, I get another. What I think is silver. I don't know if it's silver or not. Um. But it's. It's shiny, whatever it is. It's a very shiny sort of thing, but I think it is just silver. I think, yeah, because considering I've got it again. If, I mean, if it was platinum, my word, that would be incredibly lucky to get the exact same thing again. But, no. Uh, but we have the Arctic Scouts Supplementary Body Armor. Can I stop getting the supplementary? Can I actually get the actual stuff, please? Uh, so we have this belt, a bit basic, and the braces, which are a bit basic. Look at Kratosoko's booty. Isn't it a bubble butt? The next pack contains a title Galactic Commander and Arctic Scout Supplementary Body Armor again. Seriously? Seriously? I'll take the Galactic Command title though. Thank you. And I'll add to the many, 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 many titles that I already have. The next pack con. Hey, I keep missing a pack for some reason. That's really weird. Uh, Warhound, Advanced, the Cool, and Trash Receptacle. Lovely! I get another one! I will take it. Thank you very much. And I'll claim it because I want as many of those as I could possibly get. And we also have a little pet. The Warhound. Hello, Warhound. Hello. Just don't kill me with your little horns. Please. I mean, you might be small. Alright, just don't jump over the bin. Crikey. You might be small, but you're probably deadly with those horns. I mean, look at that speed ramming at me. Did you just swear? I mean, I'm debating whether to keep you out, because whilst you do make a sound, you're a lot quieter than previous pets I actually have. You're just like... So... Nah, we'll get rid of you. The next pack contains... Okay. Yeah, it, it must be silver. It must be silver. Because I also get the Voskar Chandelier. I was so excited 
I was really excited that I was getting all of these platinum stuff, but no, it definitely is silver. Anyway, Alliance Emissary, Supplementary Body Armor. Did we already have a look at that? We did. We also have Voskar Chandelier. So let's look at that Chandelier. See, I will say, the thing with the Voss, and this might sound a little bit controversial, but the sort of stuff the Voss have kind of reminds me of the Chinese. Because you know how they have like the Chinese New Year and it's got like little petals and it's like a lantern, you know, they have Chinese lanterns and it's beautiful like that. It, it just reminds me of that. And it's beautiful. I, I like things like this. It's... Oh, the, Voss are, the Voss are such a curious race, I'll admit. Not a big fan of the Voss, but they're very curious. They like to make some really interesting things, I will admit. Uh, was there anything else we had? No. Moving on then to get a altar of the Voss Mystics and Arctic Scout's upper body armor this time. Well then, I'll take the altar and I'll take the upper body armor. First of all, we'll look at the altar of the Voss Mystics. Okay, yeah, I mean, I can jump on it at least, and yeah, I can stand on the altar and. I don't know. I don't know what to do with this. It's just more for... It is more for decoration. I mean, that is what they're called. They're called decorations for a reason. But this is literally for decoration. I mean, what use would you have for this right now? I I don't know. And the Arctic Scout's upper body armor, which we can combine with the supple elementary body armor. We have some weird leather sort of gloves. Right. Uh, the braces. Uh... Mm, I wouldn't say I'm a massive fan of the upper body armor. I mean, I guess it's okay if you want to be all professional but warm, maybe? Maybe you want to be like an Imperial, uh, like an Imperial agent from, you know, the bridge crew, but you want to be warm at the same time. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, but it kind of, he kind of looks weird when he's got no trousers on. So maybe, maybe he'll look better with the trousers. But we'll see if we get the trousers. But I doubt I'll get the trousers. We have the Renderly Guardian and the Arctic Scout Supplementary Body Armor. Again, my word, we're getting repeats, repeats, repeats. Give me my Renderly Guardian, please. Um. Hmm. It's very basic. I don't really like these mounts, to be honest. They're just too basic and they're a bit bland. I mean, I know they try to spruce it up with the colors, but. I mean, how is that really spruced up? That's just. Nah, um, if it was a different colour maybe, but not those colours. Um, I do like the UI though, the little interface bit though. That's kind of cool. 18 packs to go and I still haven't figured out what that icon behind this, this thing is. Um, also, we haven't encountered a single Grand Chance cube. Curious. Advanced Viridian City, Corona, Indestructible Crystal, and Title Galactic Manda again, and well, as those stuff. I never mentioned these sorts of things because no point. Uh, let's take a look at the crystal. Um, no, no, I just, I prefer. I see it, it would be nice, but I prefer if that was like full white. But then that's just like a regular green lightsaber, isn't it? But ah. Uh, Maybe you like it? I mean, it looks different in the picture than it does in the actual thing. I mean, look. Let me go. Let me go back to the thingy. It looks. It looks white there, and it looks green. And then you go to it, and it's. It's suddenly paler in the middle and paler on the outside as well. It's. The, the image gives it no justice. It lies to us. The next pack contains though. Speak of the devil. Grand chance cube. Great, and we've also got another one of those crystals, which we don't need to look at. Alright, don't open before I seem to say so. We have exposed wiring, uh, and another trash receptacle! Lovely! I will take that again. Exposed wiring. Oh, right, okay, it is like... Big wires that have just... Come out the wall and it's broken. Although, I dare say... How on earth... Do you fit those in this wall? I mean, this wall is thin. This wall is incredibly thin, right? 
So where on earth are they fitting these three big wires in that wall? Like, through the walls? Unless it's like little tiny ones that come together to form three big ones that come out of the walls. I don't know. The next pack contains uh, the TC6 Voyager. And it has a flourish. Beautiful. Opportunist Rogue's lower body armor as well. Which one should we look at first? It's got to be the mount. The TC Voyager. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, kind of, it, it looks like a little water sub. It's probably not, but it looks like it could be a water sub. That's amazing. Ah, oh, that's a cool mount. Now, the flourish. Uh, control said. Yes. Ah, oh, is that what it does? I was kind of expecting this to pop up. That would have been way better than it just do that. It should have just popped up. Oh, well. I mean, that's, that's cool, I guess. See it from the back. Uh, no, I don't. I don't like that. I, don't, I like the mount. Don't like that. No, that should be popping up. Don't you agree? And the opportunist rogue's lower body armor. I love those trousers. Uh, the boots. Not so much. They look a bit crooked. I mean, I know it's the design on the front, but they kind of look a bit crooked and. I don't know, they look like somebody's just taken some slippers and just thrown them on some boots, you know? But I do love the trousers. I may definitely use the trousers on uh, a new outfit uh, at some point, whenever I decide to make another outfit for Granitoko. They are beautiful. Uh, beautiful trousers. But they look better in a different colour. I don't like them in red. Also, is it Rogue or is it meant to be Rouges? I don't know. I mean, it's very curious that its pats come out the same day as Rogue One. Which I'm going to go see tomorrow. I can't wait! The next pack contains a Grand Tech F11D Assault Cannon uh, and Battle Hardened Apprentices Supplementary Body Armor. Ooh, I think the other body armor looks fantastic. I really hope I get that, but I won't. First of all, here is the Assault Cannon. Like I said in the previous pack video, I hope some of you are going <laughs> over it, but I highly doubt you are. Um, what was the other thing we had? It was the Battle Hardened Supplementary Body Armor, which is... That and that. No. No. What are we looking at? What? I thought we just looked at that. We've already seen that. So what did I pick? What did I just... What? what, what, what I'm, I'm, I'm confused. I'm confused. Oh, it's the Battle Hardened... Supplementary stuff. Right, I was I was very confused. I was very, very confused. The belts. Yeah. The braces. Yeah. And the helmet. No. We are halfway. We're on the 14th pack. We have title Galactic Commander and a Grand Chance Cube. What a surprise. Yay. The next pack. Now all the Grand Chance Cubes are turning up. Could they not? That would be grand. Uh, Randy Lee Guardian again, and Battle Hardened Apprentices Supplementary Body Armor. I've already shown you that. Next pack contains uh, the Crystal and the Voskar Chandelier again. We're just getting repeats now. That, 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 that. Uh, Survivor of Staunton! <gasps> Imperial Admiral's lower body armor. Okay, is that what I was asking for before? I can't remember. But we got the Tauntaun! Yay! And of course, we shall begin with the Tauntaun, which cannot see because of the horns. I feel very bad for the Tauntaun because of that. Um, but at least it's warm. It's got a bunch of uh, warm clothing. So that's nice if it ever goes to Hoth, even though Tauntauns are from Hoth, so they're naturally going to keep warm. I think. I don't know. No, that one Tauntaun died, didn't it? Yeah, Tauntaun died in episode 5. Spoilers. Uh, well, not really. It's been out since 1980, is it? I have no idea. Oh, by the way, guys! Guys! They've already announced a sequel to Rogue One. I know, right? They're calling it A New Hope, and it's coming out in 1977? Can't wait for it. Cannot wait! 
And then I hear there might even be a sequel after that called uh, The Empire Strikes Back. I know. I know. And I, th I hear they're even going to do another sequel called Return of the Jedi. And then they may even do prequels. What? No, it's the Arctic Scouts we need. That's the lower body armor. But hey, let's look at the uh, Admiral's lower body as well. Ooh, the Force is in balance as well. That's that's good. That generally never happens. But ooh, I like that. I don't know why I like it. It's curious. I mean, that was me saying that I preferred the opportunistic. Opportunist. I can't say that. Opportunistic uh, Rogue's lower body armor. But I think I prefer this one actually. I don't know why. Even the boots. Boots are great. It's just I think I like the colour. It's the colour. It's definitely the colour. I like it. And it's uh made me attracted to it in a way. We have only eight packs left. Alright then. Next packs contain the salt cannon and the grand chance cube. Nobody cares. That 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 and that. Alter the Ross Mystics, which we've already seen, and another grand chance cube. Yeah, 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 yeah. Grand Chance Cube, Crystal, we really are just getting repeats. That, 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 and that. Uh, Eternal Mini Probe, and... Uh, uh, the Nathema Sith Spawn. Uh, and the Eternal Mini Probe as well! Let's look at the Mini Probe first! <laughs> right. Hello Mini Probe! How are you doing? You're very gold and uh... I don't know why you're gold but... I don't know... Where'd it, where'd it go? Ah! Hello! Don't do that! You look like a... A chocolate egg covered in a... Golden foil. Can I eat you? Is that bibbidi boop 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 for... Yes you can eat me Charlie. I'm delicious. Well, all right then. Nom nom. Very tasty, tasty probe. A bit more metallic than I kind of thought it was gonna be, but well, who's ready to see the Sith spawn? Are you ready? I haven't even seen it yet, so this is gonna be hopefully mind blowing. Here we go. I mean, it is just a rancor when you think about it. It has the rancor sound effect, but whoa! That looks amazing. That looks so cool. It's so... I mean, it's not... I'd say it's a reskin, but is it? A reskin is is more when they just kind of just... I don't know. Change the colours around and just add like a little bit to it. F for this, they've practically... I don't know. Added bits more to the model and... I don't know. It's, it really turns... It's up to you how you determine a reskin, but... I think they've got a bit more... Beyond a reskin, so it is basically the ranker slouch, but I like it. I really like it, and I'll never use it again because that's just me. The next pack contains Grand Chance Cube and the Crystal. Fantastic! Give me something that will blow my mind. I mean, I did get that mount. Sure, that that was like oh, wow, but um, give me something that will be like, please. That'd be great. Uh, the Zerk a spade, a spade, and a healing crystal as well. Okay, um, I thought we were done with Zerk stuff, but hey, I guess they're still appearing in packs. Great, I think. Okay, um, I mean it's very um. I can't think of the word. It's it's like your own little portable desk, if anything, except it's not a desk because where could you fit anything? There's not even a cup holder or anything like that. Um I I like I in a way I do like the texture of it. It's it's a nice sort of gold kind of texture. It's I don't know what to say about it. It's weird. In a it's kind of nice. But it's kind of boring at the same time. If that makes any sense. Very curious. Yeah, come. No, I. Oh. oh. And I just got back up. Will you behave? Thank you. 
And we have the Voskar Healing Crystal. Ooh, it's pretty. I like it. It's a pretty, it's a very pretty green. I hope they do have different colors as well. That is so nice. I love the glow. Yeah, can you stop opening and closing, please? I'm too distracted by the lovely glow. Hello? Hello? No one here. Pretty! Two more packs to go, and then we have the... Grand Chance Cubes. We have the Assault Cannon again, and the Crystal. So, we're now down to our final pack. The Opportunistic... Still can't say that word. Rogues. Upper Body Armor. Great! Scavenger Scrap. Luxury Wall Sconce. Uh, or Sons, however you say it. And Hyperspace Smuggling Roots, which nobody cares about. So, let's look at the armor first, and then we'll look at the decoration. So we have the upper body armor, which we can combine with the... What was it? Uh, oh, the lower body armor. Oh, great. Oh, fantastic. Do we have the supplementary body armor as well? We do not. But hey, who really needs it? That! That is really nice. I like that. It's almost like an alternative cough. In a way, isn't it? I really like that. Maybe not in that colour, but I really do like that. That is great. Huh. Just trying to think which character might wear that. He's he 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 lies because I never really truly think about it. It's just, I, I always think that I'm going to give it to somebody, but I never really do. The Luxury Wall Sons as well. I'm guessing that goes on a wall. It's just a guess. Don't know what gives it away. L, 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 Luxury Wall... Oh, it's a different kind of Wall Sons. I don't even know if I'm saying that correctly, but... Like the crystal. Pretty. I like that. Oh, I want more, though, so I can put them all around my stronghold. That's a pretty light... Anyway, we still have the Grand Chance Keeps to open. So, where are thou? Thou are there. Claim the stack. And the first cube contains uh, Yun Customization 2, which I don't really care about, but I've got to show you anyway. Yun Customization 2. Oh, yeah, I have Yun, don't I? Yes, I do. He's just blue. I guess that kind of looks nice on him. Um, I think I prefer him the way he is, though. Well, I don't prefer Yoon at all. I mean, who likes Yoon? Do you? No. The next cube contains medium red and dark grey die module. Well, if we get a full set, then we'll have a look at that, but we won't. Jason Wilson, light customization 6. Jason. Jason. Come back to me, my child. Come back to me. I say my child. That sounds creepy. She's not my child. Jason! That's what Jason looks like in that customization. And I can't see what she actually looks like because it's broken. But there's her in that customization. The next cube contains... Uh, Ickus XK. So I already got that. I don't think I got that, actually. That seems a bit... Cute. Oh, I do have that. Okay. Well, it's that then. I can't keep track of all the mounts I have. Come on now. Uh, that one. Licky licky. Pa pa pant. Do I have that mount? I do apparently. All right. Let's see what it does. Oh, it's a kick. Oh, I'm sure. I'm, yeah, I've definitely shown you that in the past. It's just a kick. Fair enough. Uh, Ensign Temple customization 9. Blimey, they still do stuff for Ensign Temple. Well, of course they do. They do, do it for all companions, don't they? Well, they don't really... See, they have customizations for companions you're getting, like, during Knights of the Fallen Empire and Eternal Throne, but I can't see any actual customizations for them. It's like, if I bring my... If I bring my, my Arkan out... Yes, my Arkan. <laughs> if I bring Arkan out, I will show you. See, they've got customization right there in case, I don't know, 
they do decide to bring it into the game. But they just haven't done anything. So could you do some of that please, Bioware? I'd like to see Arkan look a little bit different. Also, I didn't look at the Ensign Temple thing, but I'll have a look at that in a minute. Overwatch Officer's armor set. Alright, well then I guess we are going to be looking at that die. While we're at it, we might as well look at the last pack anyway. Uh, the Cellcath chair. I don't have one of those. Alright then. Right, so what are we looking at? We're looking at Ensign Temple, who is there. Calm down now, people. I know a lot of you uh, do drool at the sight of Ensign Temple, but I just want to remind you, she is not a real person. She is just a bunch of pixels. Uh, <laughs> I've insulted everybody there. What was I looking for? I'm looking for the... T Cellcast chair! Sweet. Ah, okay, it's these chairs. I mean, they look sleek, but they don't look very comfortable. I mean, I know Cellcast are just a bunch of slimy, icky people, so maybe they can keep their, the slime as a bit of a cushion. But for my tushy... And here is the Overwatch Officer armor set. It looks nice. Lovely and clean. Not a dirt spot on it. And now we're going to ruin it with red and dark grey. Actually, that looks alright. Yeah, I think that looks pretty good. With the red and dark grey. I, I wouldn't say it looks better than the white, actually. But it looks good. It looks good. Anyway. It's actually... This, 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 this episode has felt a little bit dull. This time, I don't know, I'm just... Maybe I'm just tired. Eh. Anyway, hi, Arkan. Something seems to be bothering you. I hope it's not me. Well, I mean, you do have a pretty big scar on your face. Um, it's a little... daunting. But nevertheless, it suits you. So anyway, until... I don't know, the new year, which I really hope is when they're going to do another pack. I hope they don't do it before the new year. Thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, and hello, everybody on Facecam. I know. Yeah. It's been weird. I've, I'm not used to this. Maybe that's why this video has been a bit weird. I'm not used to Facecam for my pack opening videos. But I'll try and do it for future videos. So, goodbye to my Christmas tree. Because it'll be coming down in a few weeks' time when Christmas has ended. But thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. And I shall see you next time. Any farewell. And Merry Christmas to you.